Thank you for taking a moment for this Rebuilt Right Now update. The Gospel for October 13th, the 28th Sunday in Ordinary Time, tells us about the encounter between Jesus and the rich young man. This passage of Scripture is one of the richest passages, no pun intended, of all the Gospels. It speaks so much to our yearning for an abundant and full life, and God's desire to give it to us. And yet, how our unhealthy attachments can get, us, can get in the way of us enjoying that life. The Gospel of Mark tells us that the rich young man asked Jesus for the more he had to do to receive eternal life. And so Jesus looked at him and loved him and said, you are lacking one thing. Go, sell what you have and give to the poor. Then you'll be dead broke and have nothing left and it'll suck to be you. Too bad, so sad, go call your dad. All right, <laughs> that's not what Jesus said. Maybe and if you caught that, good job. But I think that's sometimes what we hear and what the rich young man heard. Because the natural thought is that when I give money away, I'm diminished. Here's what Jesus said instead. Jesus, looking at him, loved him and said to him, you are lacking in one thing. Go sell what you have and give to the poor and you will have treasure in heaven. Then come follow me. At that his face fell and he went away sad for he had many possessions. You see, when we give to God, we don't lose money. We transfer it. We build treasure in heaven. Now let me admit, I don't know exactly what, how that works or what it means, but I trust Jesus. I believe that in the end, we actually only get to keep what we've given away. It's a paradox of God's kingdom. So let's pray for the grace to give and build treasure in heaven. May we follow the wisdom of Jim Elliott who said this, He is no fool who gives what he cannot keep to gain what he cannot lose. Thanks for taking a moment for this Rebuilt Right Now moment. If I can be praying for you in any way, please let email me at tom at rebuiltparish.com. Now let's pray that we would grow in generosity and giving. Heavenly Father, we take your son's words to heart that when we give, we're not losing our money. We're transferring it. We're building up a treasure in heaven that cannot be taken away from us. Help us to live out the wisdom of his teaching. We pray this in Jesus' name, amen.